Hello and welcome to Index. In this video, we will talk about trailing stop market orders. So what is a trailing stop market order? A trailing stop order is a modification of a typical stop order. This type of order can be set at a defined amount away from an asset's current market price. When the current market price rises or falls, the stop price rises or falls accordingly. For example, say you had bought one Bitcoin at 15,000, now the price is 25,000. To lock in your profit, you might decide to set a sell stop order at 24,000 to sell if the price falls to that point. But now, what if the price actually rises? With your fixed stop price set at 24,000, you're missing on profits that could be made if the stop price was closer to the current price, right? That's what a trailing stop order is for. Now, instead of a fixed stock price, you can set a trailing stock price below the current market price. So when the price rises, the stock price will also rise with it. This way you can maximize your profits before the current price dips again. Same thing with a buy order. You can set a trailing buy stop at 1000 above the market price. If the price dips more and it rises, you will profit from a far better buy price than the one you may have initially set. Now let's see how to set this up. On the trade window, click buy, then click advance and then choose trailing stop market to set this type of order. Then set how much you want to buy and the trailing amount to keep from the price. The pick price specifies what the trailing amount is going to be linked to. Either the last price, which is the last traded price as seen in recent trades under the order book, the bid price, which is the buy price or the ask price, which is the sell price. In case of a sell order, set how much you want to sell and the trailing amount to keep from the price. Finally, click place sell order and confirm your order. In the next video, we will talk about trailing stop limit, so stay tuned.